the one I do want to know though, ro rolling death cradle. <laughs> okay. <laughs> let's let's get the one knowledge check down because that one it was it's a little painful. So, so what, what's the deal with that thing? So uh, what we'll have to do is uh, I'll give up control. Hit start real quick for me. Okay. Go to practice settings and you're gonna set it to defense from training uh, mode at the top there. Defense. defense. Yep. CPU opponent action one. Uh, go ahead, select from move list. This is a nice change. You don't have to do the chain Ooh. throws yourself anymore. You can actually look. So it throws are all at the bottom. You can go through the like uh, wrap around the top or this is fine. Okay. So somewhere in here, we're looking for elbow breaker or chicken wing face lock. Well, Arm breaker. There we go. There we go. Oh, I found it. And rolling death cradle is 188. 180 okay. rolling death so, cradle. Before we click it here, I want to I want to follow the move list. It says during chicken wing face lock. So let's scroll up to chicken wing face lock two above. Uh, and then that says during <laughs> And that says during arm breaker. So we'll go all the way up to the top of this little mini. Okay. So, okay. Chain throw, there are multiple throws. In this case, every step is breakable. So arm breaker, as you can see on the right, says throw escape one. Mm, what it looks okay. like yeah so the first chance is when he does the initial grab right. the second chance is that chicken wing face locks so if you go back to 186 you'll see it has that one plus two so after okay. the arm breaker hits you say you failed that throw sure then you can try mashing one plus two okay so why don't we click on that first just click on this chicken wing face lock and uh you can back out of here and hit uh what is it play is select plus b Mm, plus do four. I have that? There oh, we go. Yeah. yeah. So there's the first throw, and there's the second throw. So we can just do those those two for now. The first one is a one break. Okay. It's one of those hidden ones that you can't tell. <laughs> so when is the tech win? I'm going to let the first one happen. So the first one happens. Yeah. Now here... What is the, the tech for that one? So are you talking about the second one, right? Yeah, the second one. Second one, as soon as you have failed the first tech window, you should be mashing your second tech window. Oh, right. it, it had to do it early. Because you're so com you're committed to this anyways. You're guessing between two uh, or sometimes three options. You just start hitting the button that you think it's going to be okay. anyways. There's no reaction. There's no way to. Uh, yeah, so there's no once visual this cue. first one happens, so I guess you, you haven't gotten to that one yet. But I'm guessing the, the point is there's actually multiple routes you can go after this first grab. And one plus two is one of them. Yes. And so I'm once the first one happens where he grabs my arm. Breaks it over this his shoulder. Second. That's the first one. So I, yeah. I, I'm in a bad spot there, and I got to start guessing. Yes. Okay. So that's why this initial one is so annoying, is because it's truly ambiguous, and then you're put in a chain. And if you guess wrong over and over, it could just be disaster. So you can now there is it. some. Okay. I'll talk a bit about the psychology a bit after, but let's go back to the pause menu and just add the rolling death cradle, um, and then we can see all three steps that you can break. So you just select Rolling Death Cradle, and it will do all three steps. So the first step is a one break. The Chicken Wing Face Lock is a one plus two break. And the Rolling Death Cradle is a two break. So does he have to go through this route? So it has to be the one, two, and then Rolling Death Fist Cradle? Like it Correct. Has to be rolling that Death route Cradle there? can only come out of this route. OK. So usually, what the, the common place advice, like the, the dude in the living room advice, is just mash two. Don't ever take the Rolling Death Cradle. So after, okay, so two is the one that will stop rolling death crate. But so yes. I'm guessing there's something else he could have done there for damage that is not a two break, but it won't be as bad as rolling death crate. Exactly. So okay. the reason people, yeah, that's why people say mash two is because rolling death cradle does the most damage. And you can, if you see how much damage you took just from the two uh, okay. hits. Yeah, it's bad. Bad yeah. time. Okay, that's good to know to save me the embarrassment that I've already felt. <laughs> so the gen yeah, the generic decision making against King's chain throws is there's a there's a max damage route and then maybe one or two lesser damage routes. And sure. as a default, if I've never fought the King player before, I'm doing the max damage break like every time. Gotcha. Right. I Let want to play the you. game. I want to play the game more. I want to get more chances to outplay you. So I'm going to save as much HP as possible. Right, right. To totally but I've, agree. <laughs> yeah. But I have played a really good King player on the West Coast, and he recognizes that psychology, so he only does the safe one. So against mm -hmm. him, we have a bit more of like a, a mind game, right? Right. Like, 
Yeah, once you're actually playing the game. I, I'm at the phase where I just need to <laughs> stop kings who are mashing from not letting me play the game. <laughs> so this is definitely good. Just a uh, hard rule for me for now. <laughs> Perfect. King starts this, I'm mashing too. I, uh, once someone forces me to evolve my game plan, I'll, I'll get there. But that's good to know. At least one should... gimmick down. <laughs> yes. There should be one more in the move list that is also very common. Um... I, it, we call it King's Bridge. I don't know if it's called King's Bridge in the move list. That's what I'm not sure about. Let's see. Uh, go ahead, scroll up a bit. Yeah, King's the King's Bridge, Bridge right there. So this not one. Escape. Ooh. So this one is weird because uh, you have. It's only a two-step throw. And the King's Bridge is if you if you lost the second step, the King's Bridge is guaranteed. Mm. So let's just look at uh, one one eighty. We'll just do one eighty. So the first break step is the two. And this is where he grabs your heel. As soon as he grabs my heel, I'm gonna mash one plus two because that denies this one that goes into King's Bridge. So once he sees you grabs your once he you see him grab your foot, I'm mashing one plus two. And that's it? That was the break. Yeah, because because that will break the step that goes into King's Bridge. Once he lands this part on you, the King's Bridge is guaranteed. So mm. it's only two steps. Heal lock. I'm mashing one plus two. The, uh, you gotta mash it early. It's okay. It's early yeah. window. Okay. The moment I see that I failed, I'm mashing one plus two already here. Dirty inputs just get me out of here. And no, it does like, damage, huh? Can that kill? It can kill him. It can kill him. Oh. Is that common to have throw breaks that actually do damage like that? It's like the old school characters, like King Nina. Um, a lot of the like the, the grappler characters have that mechanic. It's like kind of legacy. There's like a new mm. character that has it kind of, but it's it's pretty rare. So yeah, so, if you look at the King's Bridge, this is what happens uh, if I fail. I try it. Yeah. So if you fail this one, there's nothing you could do. The King's Bridge is coming, and the damage is ridiculous. <laughs> Ow. <laughs> yeah. That's like 50%. You just lose. <laughs> So yeah, as soon as my heel's getting grabbed, I'm bamming that one plus two. So King's Bridge is two, one plus two, and Rolling Death Cradle is two. Yep, and you're looking for when, as soon as okay. he grabs your heel, that's kind of like, oh, I'm mashing one plus two. Because right. these routes don't cross over. If he grabs your heel, he can't Rolling Death Cradle you. Right, right, gotcha. Okay, okay, cool. we'll see if I can remember that in a panic versus the next King player I see.